Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. So today, I like those sausages. They're quite cheap. I freeze them, then I cook them in uh, their pork sausage. Then I cook them in water for a little bit, and then I put a little bit of oil and cook them out. They're pretty good. And LaFonda said she didn't like them. I don't know why. But, and I got blueberry waffle, coffee, and my coconut yogurt. Yeah, these sausages are, you don't have to burn them. I boil them. And then I put a little bit of grease in. And they're not bad. The pork sausage. I know I don't like the chicken. So, what happened yesterday? I think the bay cleaner, not the shithead one, but the one Tuesday and Thursday, the guy, I think he quit. It was a weekend girl that works the cast at night. Saturday and Sunday, she's going to do the babies for, until they find some of them. So, she worked last night until uh, tomorrow night. You reach some extra hours, right? Um, I walked halfway with her and then I screwed it up. But, um, I think I'm going to catch the bus the next couple of days just to around. But Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Rather exercise that I'm not used to. the bus and walk home. Not used to the exercise. Yesterday I did the Italian sausage and boiled up the little potatoes and then I fried them up and put spices and cut up the sausage. I cooked it with barbecue sauce and put barbecue sauce over it. It's pretty good. Then I boiled the chicken bread. I'm going to fry it up in the frying pan. I got the eggless noodles and I got that chocolate cream and cheese and everything. Have that. They don't take that long to cook. that on the side for some chicken. The chicken I might do Greek. The Greek spice and garlic. The noodles did put sour cream and some cheese in it. Yeah, that'd be good. Yesterday was so hot, like in its 30s, so ate half, half around 5, and then the other half around 7. Because it's so hot. I got a lot last year. I didn't put the AC on, I mean everything, my bar was melting. Shithead's not a team player at all. Didn't write it in the book, didn't let us know nothing. Guess, not my supervisor, but supervisor of the car wash, whatever, the station. Not the people, but 
Anyway, told him that he could put a DEF in it, open the door. Told him he did the physically open the door. Even the other door. He does favoritism with guys, let's put it that way. Favoritism. I open up the door, he would take a fit. Gotta put the AC on. But those bars are mounted. Wow. If it's hot and AC's not on, I'm just gonna put a DEF in front of the door. The air can go through. Oh yeah, girl last night. Oh yeah, we knew that for a week. Told him last weekend. Did he mention a dot? We could never do it. They didn't want us to. Guess he's special. Piss me off. Me and the daytime girl, full time been there forever. We, do, we don't know that. That we can. Probably too. Well, you turn the heat off, the car wash, when he, when he does that, he should be putting the AC on. If it's too hot for the heat, or too hot outside temperature to have heat on, that means it's too hot in the store not to have AC on. You know what I'm trying to say. So I told you guys, right? This means the performance weekend, so yeah, I did. I knew yesterday. That's okay. Next next weekend, Saturday is close to Mother's Day, so we're gonna have it then. Me and Jenny and catch the bus stop. It should be only one fair. Because it does say ETS on the on the box. Pay five dollars, should be able to get a transfer and be good for the Edmonton buses and that. So we don't have to pay three seventy five, three seventy five again. Money rack. There should only be two dollars here. I think they're both pocketing money. One gets two fifty and one gets two fifty. Even if it was two dollars, I mean I'm gonna transfer and still have to pay the three seventy five.
crazy. That one from here, ray kissing, I can see by about. About 10, you're changing transit. When you get to number one, you're catching this transit. Number 10, you're leaving our transit and going on to the Edmonton Transit System, ETS. Said it right on the box. I go see five dollars. If you're catching our bus right into there, okay. But when you're catching two buses, one here and one there. So today's hump day. This weekend, I'm not doing a whole lot. It's my laundry. Probably get my groceries out no krill. bread and eggs and that. I'm not doing a whole lot. I blow this out of smoke and decide what I'm going to do with those chicken and noodles. I like the coconut. I love coconut. Coconut, pineapple. I still say put a little bit of garlic in that and some curry. Cook up chicken. Do a chicken curry with it. It took two people to make it. It was so. It was a banana split. It was no bake. It was a dessert. But they had to do the custard, and then you had to do this and that, and the bananas and the strawberries, and then the graham cracker and the. But man, it was good. Me and mom, me and mom would make it. Instead of the custard though, I don't know. You could probably use, I think, green wax. I don't think it had to be custard. I think we got the recipe from Leon. Leon Mary. I think we had a piece of it over there. Her place one time. Aunt Mary could cook too. Aunt Ruth, Jean, for sure. Never ate a whole lot of Ruth's cooking, but I know that she could cook. My aunt. Teresa too, I think, 
on Teresa. Lois didn't do a whole lot of cooking. Like baking and... I know Teresa, when we went over, she always had cookies and I thought, cakes and I, but I can't remember eating over there. We didn't visit very much. Vera could too, but she moved back to New Brunswick mom second it's mom, Vera, Alice. But um when they were older and the kids graduated, the three kids and the mental but I'm pretty sure she could cook, cook good, but they were older and ended up, her husband and her both having diabetes, so she didn't, uh, I think that's why she didn't bake that much, but I know the kids would cook. Mary, I think she's baked a lot. Oh, Mary. Recipe, recipe I want to try. I want to get the bigger. Um. Got the little ones there. Noodles. Rigatoni. Look, I seen someone just took um, mozzarella and cut it and then just stuffed it inside. And then put your spaghetti sauce and your cheese and put it in the oven. What an idea that is. just put it right inside the noodle. I got the little ones. I could do that today, but I think I'll just do the Greek style. I feel like I'm where I got that sour cream and everything, eh? Do the Greek style um, noodles. I'll run them good over cold water. Sour cream garlic. Might not put no cheese. Just sour cream and garlic. And then have the Greek chicken. That's an idea. Won't take me that long to cook it. This might take an hour to upload. Yesterday, my video was what, 20 minutes? Took forever. I mean, I even turned my router on and off, thinking maybe I would, I don't know, I don't think I got the fastest speed, but it doesn't interfere from streaming something, but if I upload, anywho, I'm almost, I'm getting a 5k, don't forget to subscribe because I still have something. I got a special. I got a special. I got a special. Anywho. <clears throat> Probably be in June. I'll do it in June when I got those two weeks off, eh? So, you guys have a good day. There were no questions. Nobody asked any questions.
I know people want me to have thrown them over and do videos, but I mean, he's in Edmonton. I don't have a vehicle. The pond is working every weekend. I mean, it's just hard to get a phone. And Jenny, she's biking everywhere now. Claire got a bike from last year. Jace got a bike from last year. She got her bike. She went to three parks on last Saturday, and then she went to uh, one park, but it was further down. It was quite a jaunt. So she'll be out now. That's good. She'll be out every weekend with the kids. She really don't like them playing around her area. And you know what I mean? In certain weeks, I better she likes going and taking them out and taking them to the park and it's a lot better than her walking I'll give her my basket though I just got to get a smaller one she needs a basket to put everything in there so oh do I gotta get up I'm catching a bus I got last one, Bonnie said, that's only gonna last a week. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what craziness I'm gonna get myself into here soon. So, you guys all have a good day and a cigarette time.